Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lanyel Kuzar and I'm the owner of Yes Event Decor and More. So in this video, I wanted to give all of my balloon designers out there, I wanted to give you guys an idea for a girl's birthday party. So I'm gonna be doing a balloon backdrop and then I'm gonna be putting some props in front of that balloon backdrop and I wanted to show it to you just in case you have some clients that are looking for ideas for the girl's birthday party, all right? So let's get started. So before I hang my backdrop, I just wanted to take a second and just answer some of the questions that I get from you guys on my boxwood backdrop. So as you can see here, I keep my backdrop rolled up so that it's ready to go for all of my events. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hang it backwards because I get a lot of questions from you guys on how do I attach this boxwood backdrop to my backdrop stand. So I'm just going to turn it around so that you guys can see how I attach it, okay? Now, as you can see, I use zip ties. So I use zip ties, also known as cable ties, to attach the boxwood backdrop to my stand. And then I also use zip ties to attach this cover that you see to the back of my boxwood backdrop. Now some of these zip ties are sticking up, so I'm just gonna pull them down. I don't like for them to stick up. I like to hide them behind the backdrop, okay? So that's what I'm just gonna do, is I'm just gonna pull these zip ties down and if you guys have any questions on this backdrop cover that I put on the back of this boxwood backdrop, I'll be sure to put a link to the video where I set this up, okay? So you guys can check that out. All right, so now I'm just gonna turn this over. I'm gonna pull this down and then I'm gonna turn this over and finish this backdrop.
All right, guys, so this is my favorite part. I'm gonna be adding my finishing touches and making these balloons look really pretty. So as you can see here, I have some purple butterflies. I got these a while ago from Etsy. I used them at one of my baby shower events and I decided to save them. As you can see, some of them have those little pearls on them. They are gonna look so pretty with the balloons. And just in case you're wondering how I'm gonna add these butterflies, I'm gonna be using my glue dashes. You guys know I use these a lot. Pretty much anytime I wanna add something to the balloons, I use these glue dashes. And next I'm gonna be adding some leaves. I think these are gonna be so pretty with these balloon colors. And plus, as you guys know, anybody who has watched that Encanto movie, Isabella's gift was creating flowers, right, and leaves. So this ties in perfectly with this theme. So if you guys have any questions on how I add my leaves, let me show you, okay? I put my leaves in my extra balloons. So this is an 18 inch balloon and I put about three stems of leaves in there. Last but not least, I'm gonna be adding some flowers. How can you have an Isabella theme, right? If you don't have flowers, that was her gift. So I have a few different types of purple flowers here that I'm gonna be adding, and I'm gonna be putting these in some small balloons as well. So make sure you do not add flowers to your balloons without putting them in some balloons or floral tape or something because they will pop your balloons, all right? So this is what I'm gonna be adding. I'm so excited. Mm -hmm. 